guys, it's Mariana. Welcome back to my channel. And I just have to say to you guys, happy 2019. It is finally here, the, the new year of 2019. And I want to be talking about what are the goals that I want to be doing in 2019. And I'll tell you what my goals are. So the first goal I want to be talking about is all of this. I mean, girl, I am talking about fashion. I mean, the new year is going to be, I mean, the new year is already up and what I got for Christmas this year is my dad got me a whole bunch of makeup supplies that I am really addicted to and I'm talking about ELF or should I say ELF. <laughs> it is like one of the most amazing makeup products that I love wearing and if you guys really love really love that makeup too. I recommend going to, to get that brand and start the New Year's off with a new style or a new look if you want to if you want to look all stylist and fashionist or be all nice and feminine like me. I would recommend going get Elf and get the whole new style for me. I mean I love Elf. I mean I love any kind of makeup brand. I just want to look all fashion for the new year and I bet you guys do so so yes, makeup is like one of my first options. The next brand I want to be talking about for the year 2019 is uh, me and my boyfriend made a pact that me and him would both be all healthy for this year, try to lose weight together and stay active. And I know if you guys do too, and I've been trying, I mean, I've been trying to, to lose a lot of weight and it doesn't, it just, I mean, every time I look in the mirror, I think of myself as, ugh, I hate how my body lo looks. I, I don't like it. I just want to get rid of it. And a lot of people keep saying to me, you're not fat. You're not a medium. You're beautiful. You're stylish. And I think you look very healthy. You're a very healthy girl. And I... I would appreciate how people would say that to me, but sometimes in my own words and my own head, I I just don't like the way how I look. So to be honest, this, I mean, for the past 2018, I haven't been very healthy lately. I mean, every time that I go to work on Thursdays and every time that I go to work on Thursdays, they always, they always have to bring Donuts in the break room that I'm like addicted to. I mean, seriously, who who doesn't love donuts? So my favorite donuts that I get every time that I go to work on Thursday and take a break is like a chocolate eclair or any other kind of cream filling donut that I'm really addicted to. I mean, I I am addicted to donuts and any kind of sweets like candy, ice cream cake, any type of sweets. I'm like a sweet tooth person and I'm trying to cut down all of that and try to stay all healthy and I bet you guys are too. So that's what I'm trying to do for this year 2019 is to stay healthy and eat the right kind of sugar instead of the bad kind of sugar that you see in bakeries. I'm trying to I am trying to do recipes that are much more better for you, have the right vitamins, have the right stuff to help you to lose weight. And my boyfriend is going to be doing that too, help me lose the weight. And I'm going to be helping him to stay healthy too. We're all trying to stay healthy for the new year. And I want to get back to my original weight. So I'll tell you the next part. The next step I want in 2019 is... Hoping I'll get a job recommendation pretty soon. I've been trying to fill out every application that I want for my dream job as a career. I want to work at a children's daycare, a children's aid education teacher. I mean, I love children. I really want to work at a daycare or a preschool as, as far as I know. I mean, I've been trying so hard I've been trying so hard in 2018 to, to fill out all applications and at where I live to to get the to get the dream job that I want 
that I ever wanted. It's, it's a, I mean, it's everything that I always wanted ever since I was growing up in high school and I really wanted to take care of kids. I love kids. I love taking care of babies. And I know that if you guys really want to have the job that you want to, I wish you guys for the best of luck. And if you hate the job that that you're working with right now and it's only part time and you want the job that that you want to get, I would be, I would really believe in you. I mean, I hope you guys really believe in me cuz I really want to take care of a nice a nice 2-year-old or a 5-year-old. I mean, I would do the best of the job that I would want to do to to take care of kids and toddlers and babies however I can. I mean, I've been doing a lot of education in college. I've been doing a lot of ed education of Joe Frost, of Super Nanny, and it's a really good educational. I know I keep saying educational a lot. <laughs> and I really do want to, I really do want to have this career taking care of kids. So the next thing I want in 2019 is love and I am ha I'm having the best relationship I have with me and Kyle it is it is like the most wonderful thing in my life when I first met him it was like something I never experienced before I mean he is not like any other guy that I've been with he totally understands me and loves me the way who I am and I love him the way who he is and how he takes really good care of his little brothers and his little sister and the funny thing is that his younger brother has a bit of a crush on me and <laughs> he would do anything to the he would do anything to love me and take good care of me and I would do anything for him too and I love cooking for him I love taking good care of him and taking care of his little siblings like I'm part of his family because it feels like that I am part of his family and his mom loves me his his grandparents love me and I and I love them too and I want to continue on on building that family even though I've been dating him for a few months but my heart wants what the heart wants I would never want to let them go and if you guys haven't seen the Christmas present video that I did on Christmas on Christmas Day. You should go check that out. It's when me and my boyfriend were opening gifts and I, oh my god, I forgot to tell you this, what I didn't record on that day. So the thing that I forgot to record on, on one of my Christmas gifts is a beautiful necklace that, that my boyfriend gave me on, on Christmas morning. It is a Disney Castle necklace that, that is real silver and is kind of hard to explain. I'm like really shocked and like I was going to cry when he gave it to me. It was so beautiful and I will show you the necklace. It's right upstairs in my room and I'm going to go grab it. So this is the necklace that Kyle gave me on Christmas Day. It is... The Disneyland Castle necklace is me. And as you can see right there, the diamonds on the castle. I don't know if you guys can see it because of the lighting, but it has like green, purple, and oh I didn't even I didn't even see the third color there. It's the pink diamonds and it is all real silver on here that I am like shocked. And the case, I'm not even gonna say the price on it cause I, I don't wanna spoil you guys, but you can find this online on Disney.com or any other sites that, excuse me, <laughs> that has this necklace and you'll find out the price there. I'm not even gonna say it. My boyfriend might be watching this, so love you honey. And the case says, Laughter is timeless. Imagination has no age. Dreams are forever. And it says on here, Walt Disney. And I want this dream to be forever. I, I love him. I never want to lose him. And it's the most beautiful, beautiful thing that has ever, that I ever seen in my life. It's like, in my head, it's like, it's kind of like 
seen like a promise necklace that you get for your loved ones. And I know if you guys heard of a promise ring or an engagement ring, but this is like just the beginning of of me and my boyfriend. It is really beautiful. And I bet one of my employees at work might did the same thing to his girlfriend and I wish the best of luck. And his name is James and I forgot what his I forgot who his girlfriend's name was and I wish for the best of luck for you too. If James, if you gave your girlfriend something like like this on Christmas, I I would have to say it, it would be very beautiful on her. And when I took a look at the diamonds, I was like, "Oh my god, they match my nail colors and I know that my nails look pretty messed up right now." So, I I wouldn't want to do that. Okay, so I think that's all I want to be talking about for this year, 2019, and I wish you guys the best of luck of this year, and I hope you have a very great new year, and I love you guys, and thank you so much for watching this. Please, please leave a comment down below of what you're going to do this year for 2019, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and... Wish me the best of luck and wish my boyfriend the best of luck. I love him and I love you guys. And I want to thank you so much for watching my upcoming of 2019, even though it's already 2019. So thank you guys for watching.